Hi, I'm Fire Chief Mike Meyer, and today we're out at Merrick's Towing uh, in Lakeville, working on auto extrication with our firefighters. It's a training that we do uh, at least once a year, if not twice a year. It all depends on availability of, of cars for us to, uh, to use for training. Uh, but today's scenario is we have two cars to use. Uh, one, we're going to work on stabilizing the vehicle so that uh, we use struts and such and cribbing, so if the vehicle's on its side or the roof that we know how to properly deploy our cribbing and struts to stabilize it. And the second vehicle that we have set up is we're going to actually use the Jaws of Life for our cutting tools, spreaders to take off doors, open up the hood, uh, and such like that if we have to get a patient out of there. We have a topic once a month. For this month, as an example, we're doing auto extrication. And the importance of that is that we have to keep our skills fresh, how to work our tools and all of that. But the other side of it is technology is always changing. So in a good example on newer cars, any car that is now being built 2019 and current uh, is now using laminate glass similar to your windshield. So if you've seen videos of somebody walking up and breaking a window in a vehicle, that no longer happens on newer vehicles because it's, it's laminated and it will not come apart. So we have to know how to access that window to get into the vehicle if we need to and using our tools that we have available. The other side for newer vehicles is just the strength of the metals that they put into them uh, is how we're gonna cut those cars open to access the patient. Uh, so a good example is that typically we're gonna try to take the door off from the hinge point versus the door opening where you open your, like you manually open the door to get in as a passenger. We're actually gonna cut hinges to open that door because it's faster for us to get that direction. And that's just a change in how the cars are being built. So I'd like to do a, a good shout out to Merrick's for allowing us to come out to their site and giving us cars to cut apart. Uh, and then, you know, this, this helps us keep our community safe by keeping our skills up to date. And you as Lakeville, as our community, please make sure that you're driving safely, you're not texting and driving, wearing your seatbelt, doing all the appropriate site, things when you're behind the wheel. Keep our community safe by keeping our community safe.